so in this video I just want to explain to you why we are having small lavas like this and big lavas like this all right and you know that is unfortunate but it's just that that is the way it is for all animals all animals don't really need to be at the same size and aside that some do um the same way we have stone goods in catfish farming that is the same way we have stone goods here too there are some levels that you feed from now to jesus cup they will still be the same way they are due to they have stone goods like this one now see how small it is all right and that's how it is among all of them so we are trying to make sure that we have a proper feeding schedule for them so that they can they can grow big and not only grow big also grow very fast so i guess you will not be i guess you'll be familiar with what i'm doing here i'm trying to sort out the um the black ones from the white one because all these are already in pupupi stage and we have to remove these black ones so in this video i just want to let you know that sometimes that when collecting the eggs you might collect the eggs at different time and date and that can also cause them to have different goods all right but as it is now we still have some a lot of barbs that we need to sort and at the same time we also need to put them into the bsf net for them to metaphonic to fly like all these bible in week time they will become fly so and as i said before these black black ones they are no longer eating so there's no need of feeding them just feed only the white ones so that they can be able to go to i'm talking about these white ones so it's very very proper for you to feed them so that they can also join the black ones and when they when they go to the black stage they will also make the phone into fly and we extract the eggs from them all these white ones so just like that that is the way we are actually making sure that we have a lot of lovers in our farm to feed our animals and the way the price of feed is going up now I think this is an option this is an option for us to make sure that um, we have potentious ingredients when making our feed alright because the, the 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 operational cost for BSF is not as much as um, as soya beans. I hope you are, hope you are getting me because if we decide to cultivate um, soya beans, you have to wait up to like six months before you can harvest it. But I can invest this in just 8 days or 16 days maximum. So you can see the difference. So depending on what you use in your farm, just ensure that you minimize costs and you provide the best for your customers. So I'll end this one here.